Hello my friend and welcome to my channel where I cover past, present and future content on the British Royal Family. If you're new to my channel and like what you see, please be sure to hit like and subscribe. And if you've been to my channel before, welcome back. So today we're going to be covering 20 interesting facts on Her Royal Highness Princess Anne. We'll start the video with a quick introduction about Her Royal Highness Princess Anne, who is also known as the Princess Royal, but we'll cover more of that later. Anne, the Princess Royal, was born Anne Elizabeth Alice Louise. She was born on the 15th of August 1950. She's a member of the British Royal family and she's the second child and only daughter of the late Queen Elizabeth II and Prince Philip, the Duke of Edinburgh. Anne is the only sister of King Charles III. She was born in third in line in succession to the British throne and has been since 1987 known as the Princess Royal, a title which is held for life. Born at Clarence House, Anne was educated at Benedict School and began undertaking royal duties upon reaching adulthood. Anne performs official duties and engagements on behalf of the monarch. She is a patron and president of over 300 organisations. Anne married Captain Mark Phillips back in 1973. They separated in 1989 and divorced in 1992. They have two children, Peter Phillips and Zora Tyndall. She has five grandchildren. Within months of her divorce in 1992, Anne married Commander Lena Vice Admiral Sir Timothy Lawrence whom she had met while he served as a mother's equerry between 1986 and 1989. Princess Anne is described as a strong-willed, private and hard-working, as a no-nonsense and low-key person. Anne is often uncomfortable in the spotlight and she prefers a private lifestyle with her horses and her family. However, dis despite her dislike of publicity, Anne is not a shy person. Anne, like Kate, the Princess of Wales, is said to apply her own makeup, and her style has its own signature bun. But unlike other female royals, Anne is also believed to not have a fashion stylist or advisor. Instead, Anne chooses to choose her own outfits, many of which are decades old. She is known as the Thrifty Princess and is sometimes referred to as this. She is the president of the UK Fashion and Textile Association and is very interested in sustainable fashion. The Reliable Royal is one of the most beloved figures in the royal family. Here we're going to share some fun and interesting facts about the Princess Royal from a blunt response and a sharp attitude which she inherited from her late father, Prince Philip, to a track record of being the Royal Rebel. We list some of the favourite and interesting facts about Princess Royal. Number one, she was the first Royal to compete in the Olympic Games. Princess Anne became the first member of the British Royal family to compete in an Olympic Games competing in the 1976 Montreal Olympic Games as part of the British equestrian team she rode the late Queen's horse, Goodwill, in the event. Anne is a knight, number two. In classic Princess Anne style, when she was appointed to the Order of the Garter back in 1994, she requested to be installed as a royal knight of the Order and not as a lady. The Order is the oldest and most senior Order of Chivalry in Britain. Each year it's celebrated with a procession of special service. Number three, she famously faced down a kidnapper and uttered a now iconic line. In 1974, the then 23 year old Princess Anne was traveling back to Buckingham Palace after, event, after attending a charity event with her first husband, Captain Mark Phillips. Terrifyingly, the gentleman called Ian Ball shot Anne's chauffeur and security officer, 
and demanded Anne get out of her car. The princess replied with a classic not bloody lately. He was planning to kidnap the princess for a two million pound ransom. Number four, she chose not to give her children titles. That's right, unlike her other three siblings, the princess royal is the only royal who chose not to give her children any titles. I think it was probably easier for them, she told Vanity Fair back in 2020. I think most people would agree that there are downsides to having titles. Number five. Princess Anne's first wedding included another royal first. Princess Anne's wedding to Captain Mark Phillips was the first time the surname Mountbatten at Windsor appeared on an official document. Number six. After the death of her mother, Princess Anne made history. That's right. Princess Anne was the first woman to ever participate in what is known as the Vigil of the Princes. Following the death of her mother, the the late Queen Elizabeth II, in September 2022. The Vigil of the Princesses has only taken place twice before, following the death of King George V and following the death of the Queen Mother in 2002. It's called the Vigil of the Princesses because George V's four children, then King Edward VIII, Princess Albert, Henry and George, stood guard at their father's coffin on January the 28th, 1936, at Westminster Hall. For the Queen Mother, Prince Charles, Prince Andrew, Prince Edward and Viscount Lindley stood vigil. Number seven, Princess Anne has been married twice. Her first marriage to Captain Mark Philip was only the second time in 200 years that a royal had married a commoner. It's a description for someone who had no title to inherit from their father. 500 million people worldwide watched her wedding to Captain Mark Phillips on November the 13th, 1973. Number 8. Princess Anne divorced and got married in the same year. That's right, Princess Anne divorced Mark Phillips in 1992 and went on to marry Timothy Lawrence in December of the same year. Now a Vice Admiral, Timothy was a formal Navis officer and a query to the late Queen Elizabeth. Number nine, she became the first member of the British royal family with a criminal record. Princess Anne became the first royal with a record at least in modern day age. In 2002, Princess Anne and her husband took their bull terrier, Dotty, out for a walk in Windsor Great Park. Dotty happened to get loose and attack two children, leaving them with bites and scratches. She later admitted to violating the dangerous dog act. Number 10. Anne was nominated for a Nobel Peace Prize. President Kuanda of Zambia nominated the princess for a Nobel Peace Prize back in 1990 for her extensive work with Save the Children that had been for over two decades. With her work at the time, she had travelled over 26 countries and overseen life-changing projects. Number 11. Her unique style is a trademark. Even before the Kardashians started wearing futuristic looking sunglasses, they've been a style staple of the princess. She also famously wears clothes that are decades old, as we mentioned earlier, embracing sustainable fashion long before it became a trend. Number 12. Royal Siblings Anne and Charles seemingly have the closest and strongest bond out of all their siblings. Since they were close in age, the brother and sister duo were toddlers when they moved into Buckingham Palace following their mother's coronation. Number 13. Princess Anne is considered the hardest working royal. She regularly tops the list of the hardest working royals, attending more in public engagements on the royal circular than any other of her family members. 
Number 14, her favourite meal is somewhat unusual. For her 70th birthday, Anne Guest edited an edition of Country Life. In it, she revealed her favourite game recipe, deviled pheasant. Fancy trying it? Here's what you need to know. Grab your pheasants, poach, shred the meat in poaching juice, cover the pheasant with whipped cream, mix with mango, chutney and Worcester sauce. Heat if you dare. Ooh, don't know if I fancy that. But moving on to number 15, what is Princess Anne's hairstyle called? The bouffant. Princess Anne's famously swept up bouffant is reminiscent of a ballerina chagon. It was debuted in the early 1980s and she's not changed it since. Number 16. Anne's beauty. The appreciation of beauty is subjective. The Princess Royal was stunning as a young woman, but she's so much more than just how she looks. Anne is admired for her worth ethic, a straightforwardness, a sense of duty, and mostly for her intelligence. Number 17. Anne's daughter. The Princess Royal's only daughter, Zora Phillips, competed in the British equestrian team at the Olympic Games back in London 2012, where she won silver in the team event and becoming the first member of the British Royal family ever to win an Olympic medal. Number 18. Tiara. Princess Anne's wedding tiara. The Queen Mary Fringe tiara was also worn by her mother, the then Princess Elizabeth, on her wedding day. And most recently, if you've noticed, by Princess Beatrice at her wedding. Number 19. Ladies in Waiting. The Princess Royal has 11 ladies in waiting, one of whom accompanies her on official engagements. Two of them have worked for Her Royal Highness for over 50 years, three for over 40, and five of them for over 30 years. Number 20. Title. The Princess Royal. Princess Royal is a style customary but not automatically awarded by the British monarchs to their eldest daughters. Although purely honorarily, it is the highest honour that may be given to the female member of the royal family. There have been seven princess royals. Princess Anne became princess royal back in 1987. Royal protocol means that the title is held for life, even if the bearer outlives the monarch, so the title can be held the title cannot be held by two people at the same time, which means Princess Charlotte therefore will only be eligible for the title in the event that Princess Anne passes away and the Prince of Wales becomes king. Well, that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching.